Welcome back 513. Now we are finding out more about a Lafouche Parish deputy who was killed in the line of duty. Officials with the Lafouche Parish Sheriff's Office say 44 year old Sergeant Nicholas Pepper was finished with his duties for the night when he helped home a police with a pursuit that ended up being his final moments. WDSU reporter Shay O'Connor shows you how the community is remembering the sergeant. Get here along Highway 1 where the accident happened, a blue line flag, and then also some flowers here for the fallen sergeant. Over to my left, what's left of the wreck? Just a couple of hours ago, a convoy led by officers passing in this area and also in front of the Lafouche Parish Sheriff's Office. That convoy carrying the body of Sergeant Nicholas Pepper. Such a somber scene where officers who worked alongside of Sergeant Pepper stood outside to watch. Now, Nick's wife also works with Lafouche Parish Sheriff's Office, assigned to the DA's office. I'm told she and their three kids are too shaken up to speak at this time. Pepper was killed when a suspect rammed his vehicle into Pepper's unit as he was parked. I'm told Pepper had been with the Lafouche Parish Sheriff's Department for more than 15 years, but his time in law enforcement spanned easily more than two decades. I spoke with one of his friends, Christine Roussel. Just so happened she's the DA of Lafouche Parish and says Pepper was a kind soul who absolutely loved law enforcement through and through. Um, Nick and I were really good friends. We, when I was a prosecutor in the courtroom, we worked many cases together as district attorney. We, of course, had many conversations and we worked closely together again. He was not only a detective, he was not only a sergeant, he was a personal friend of mine and, and he's going to be missed. The suspect, I'm told, is currently being treated at an area hospital. When he's released, he will be arrested. His name and charges have not yet been released. Meanwhile, a, a funeral has been planned for the fallen officer. That will be held on Wednesday. Reporting from Lafouche Parish, Shay O'Connor, WDSU News.